Alright, so you want to take the OSCP, but you don't know how to practice for Active Directory. That's the purpose of this video. Let's jump into it. I tried to put these in order for you guys to kind of get an idea of how to practice for Active Directory and where to go. And the first is going to be try Hack Me. This is the go-to place you're going to learn a lot, especially if you're new to Active Directory. I would say do each one of these labs several times so that way you have the hang of going through Active Directory and what you can look for in each way to kind of gain enumeration of different networks. So the Try Hack Me Labs is going to be the first go-to place. Second is to configure your own Active Directory. So download a Windows box onto your VirtualBox or VMware and build your own Active Directory lab. This is going to give you a good idea of the ins and the outs and also while you're building it look into turning off and on um, different things within SMB or within different users give users different privileges and set up maybe a MySQL database and when you're doing all of this you are going to learn about what can be turned on what can be turned off try turning off Windows Defender and turning on a different firewall it will give you a lot of new insights into how Active Directory is configured and how it is set up and what exactly you can do with exploiting some of these different settings that you can set on Active Directory. And the third thing you're going to want to know, this you isn't really this isn't really practicing, but it's something you're going to want to know is all of these impacket tools. You will need to go and read about all of these different impacket tools. They are used heavily in Active Directory, so go out and read about the impacket tools. There are a couple of different boxes on Hack the Box where you're going to get a lot of use out of the impacket tools. I think one of them is Querier, you have Active, and you also have sauna all three of those you're going to use a lot of impact tools really you're going to use them on a lot of boxes you can use these on just regular windows boxes as well not just active directory so you can go out and read about these impact tools that will be very helpful to you and then probably if you're shooting for the oscp you'll have to pay for this practicing on proving grounds is going to give you the opportunity to practice on boxes set up by offensive security Windows boxes set up by offensive security to be more specific and you're going to be able to practice a lot of enumeration. It'll also help you get the initial foothold with the OSCP because it is set up by offensive security. It will be a great place to go and practice your enumeration. All right, and that is five tips on how to practice Active Directory for the OSCP. If you have any more, you can go ahead and leave them in the comments down below.